Welcome back, little beans. Warning, the following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in the need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite fictional character. There won't be any NSFW versions on this ASMR. This is for all ages and it's appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, Go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snag on some pockies, sip on some peppermint tea, and enjoy this ASMR. Ah, that was such a great idea. We have to eat lunch. Can't go out doing our wedding planner on an empty stomach. <laughs> ah. So, uh, do you know a good place where we can do our wedding planners, love? Oh, your man. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. Somewhere in the mall. Hmm. Well, of course we need to make plans. I did ask for your hand for a reason. Because I love you. <laughs> now let's see here. Where could it be? Oh, it's on the left. <laughs> We're going right. How silly of me. <laughs> Alright, um, let's go back left. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not that blind, dear. I'm fine. Hmm, it's a nice place here. Hmm. Oh, I guess there's someone that could help us. Hello, excuse me. Oh, afternoon, you two. Yes, uh, good day. Uh, me and my, uh, fiancé want to stop doing a wedding planner and plan for our marriage. Oh! <laughs> of course, that sounds very lovely. Um, so do you have a date that you want to, um, assign for your marriage? Like, what day or... Mm, we haven't thought that through. We just want to talk about the theme and, uh, what we should wear and have, uh, you know, maids and groomers are uh, best people to, uh, more like a, like, like a setter. Oh, I understand what you mean, sir. Um, I guess we can look through some things and discuss, and then maybe you'll tell me, like, when you'll have your wedding. Sounds good. What do you think, love? Alright, let's talk about it. Okay, so for the first question, um... Is it going to be like a small wedding, a high class wedding, or court wedding? We just thought of doing a small wedding. Just families and close friends. We don't, um, of course, I'm from a band gorillas and I don't want everyone to attend. Oh my god, my daughter loves your music. She's, you're like, you're definitely her favorite. You're, you're 2D, right? Yes, ma'am, I'm 2D. Um, maybe before you go, um, maybe you can sign my daughter's autograph, because she would love that. Of course, that's fine. Alright, a very small wedding. Um, any themes that you two talked about? Uh, not to sound kind of weird, we kind of wanted a little dark. As you can see, um, me and my uh, fiancé are into horror, so we thought of doing, you know, lots of maybe black and purple, maybe red oh so sort of like a dark victorian vampire wedding yes okay that sounds awesome we can totally do that oh, sweet hmm i think i know like a sort of victorian gothic church there's around here and uh, maybe we can use that if you don't mind you know doing at a church or somewhere like oh i don't mind a church Okay, we can use that. Um, it's... Hmm, I think I need to remember and search it up, but, um... I'll have to write it down, but, uh, don't worry. I would write everything down and, um, I can send you my email and, you know, give you updates on how things are. But, um, anyways. Um, so... Any type of flowers you want around your wedding? Hmm, we have thought of roses. Different kind of colors, like black, red, um, white, of course. Um, sort of like a corpse bride in a way, from, you know, 
a corpse bride. Oh, of course I know about the movie. Um, okay, so something like that. Maybe some blue too. Uh, yeah, a little bit of blue. Okay. Um, what about the outfits for the bride's uh, maids? Or the women of honor? You wanted to do like a blood red. Like, like a wine red, right? Okay, we can do a, a, a wine red. Um, I think that look very beautiful. Um, what about the flower girl? Do you have someone to be a flower girl? Oh, uh, actually, we have one. Her name's Noodle, and um, she will be our flower girl. <laughs> That's adorable, okay. What about the ring bearer? Uh, we'll see. They'll need to talk about that later, but um, we do have our flower girl. Well, that's fine, that's okay. Um, hmm. What about dresses for the bride, of course? Any color or just traditional white? You want to go black? Okay. <laughs> I guess not everything has to be too traditional. It can be all very crazy and all, so. We can do a black wedding dress, and yes. I think, it's, I think it'll be very beautiful, and I think it will fit the vampire theme. Well, yes, of course, the groom can look a little crazy. Um, I guess any for you, um, Tootie? <laughs> Maybe some fake fangs? <laughs> okay, you two are too adorable, oh my god. <laughs> okay, um, hmm. Do you want, uh, like an after, um, like wedding, like, um, like a dance, and some food, some drinks. Um, yeah, sure. I guess I didn't mind that. Um, you know, family gathering and talk about, like, um, you know, the man's best friend to talk about, you know, the fun memories we've had each other, the women of honor too, and yeah, we can have some food there too. Okay, good, because there's a area where, it's like a nice little garden, and it's, I think it fits like the Dracula um, garden, in a way, so, okay, we can use that, and I think it's just the day, have you guys thought of a day when you two want to get married? Uh, I guess we have decided, oh, tell me what day, um, maybe October 20th, October 20th, yes, Okay, October 20th. That's perfect. I guess we need to get everything done by two months, so that would make it 2,000 pounds. 2,000 pounds. Yes. Okay. Um, it is going to be a one day, so, um, okay. We can do that. Okay. Um, I'll set everything up if you want to pay right now or pay afterwards. I, I can pay for it. I, I can pay for it. <laughs> Great. Um, yes, dear. You can go look at the dresses. Oh, okay. Maybe after paying, um, maybe we could um, do a little... Uh, maybe between me and the bride should um, test out some dresses. Oh, that sounds good. I don't want to be spoiled by seeing my beautiful fiancé's beauty. <laughs> Want to keep it as a surprise. Alright. Alright, card. Soy. There you go. And maybe before you leave, um, or do the dresses, um... Autograph from my daughter. Oh, yes! <laughs> How could I forget? <laughs> there you go. Thank you. <laughs> Alright. Come on, dear. Um, let's check out some black dresses. I may have a few, and hopefully you would like one of them. Don't want the groom to pee. <laughs> I went for you by the ring store, love. So, just to check out some rings. Love you, too. Alright, come with me, miss. So, I only have about five black dresses that are suitable for brides, so maybe you can take a look and maybe try them on. Well, of course, you can choose one of them. But if the other one doesn't fit, I do have some other sizes, too. Oh, honey, I think they look great. What are you talking about? I bet many of these would fit you. Okay, you want to try on the fourth one? Alright. 
Usually the others always have the slim dresses, you know, nowadays women aren't always wanting to look slim and they get the very skinny dresses, but okay, we can do this one. Um, do you need help any, you know, help you put it on? Zip anything up? Okay, um, so there's a fitting room right there and uh, if you need any help with any adjustions, I'd be glad to help. Okay. You're done? Okay, come on in. Wow. <laughs> Sweetie, you gotta take a look at yourself. Maybe. You look beautiful. I, in my opinion, I think this is the one. It really brings out the gothic in you. I think Tootie is going to love this. That's the point. You need to look very beautiful for your groom. The man that you're going to marry. You need to shine. That's the point of a wedding. Is to show that the bride must only be the most beautiful one. <laughs> I mean it. That's the whole point. What do you think? You like this one? Alright. Um, how about you take it off and I'll keep it in safe hands and wash it for you if you want. And, um... Are you, are you two, like, paying separately? Okay, hon, it's not. It's about, um, $400. Yes. You wanna pay? Okay. Go ahead and take it off, and I'll take good care of it. I'll have, um, Barbara put in safe hands so she can wash it, um, and then we can pay at the front, okay? Alright. Uh, cashier card. Card? Okay. Take your time, and I'll meet you at the front. Oh, hello, dear. <laughs> so, how was the little dress shopping you did? Oh, that's, that's wonderful. Um, I was just looking at some rings, you know, and I did purchase some, so... I want to leave that a surprise. Alright? <laughs> I think they're going to like the ring. Anyway, I guess we're done for now, and I can't wait for October 20th. Can't wait for you to become Mrs. Pot. Anyway, um, what do you think a Russell could be or a ring bearer? Yeah, I thought so myself. And the dog would be a really inappropriate ring bearer. Sadly, he's going to be the man of honor. Hopefully he doesn't say anything bad about me. Yeah. Let's head back. I'm tired. You too. Alright. Come on, let's go home. <laughs> <laughs>